I'm Charles, an elementary student from Burke, Virginia. This is my ship. I'm pleased to introduce the video trailer for Fleet by Asney. Thanks, Charles. That's a beautiful ship. We've had a lot of interesting affordances with everything that's going on. We moved to Twitch right away when things went virtual. So we had weekly competitions where we supported people by showing more about Fleet and then hosting award ceremonies on a weekly basis to celebrate students that were really achieving greatness in the game. The Twitch platform also gave us this really nice opportunity to do a long look at data, how to use data in your engineering decision making. And we were also able to do virtual live activities, taking some of our traditional activities that we do during STEM events. We had to rework them a little bit by making the boats a lot bigger, dyeing the water blue so it's more visible, but we were still able to convey that information about forces, motion, that we do through our hands-on activities and encourage students to do them at home with common household objects. We still support teachers with NGSS aligned curriculum for middle and high school. We're looking ahead to continuing this momentum with virtual fleet summer camps. Those summer camps and the curriculum are available on our website, navalengineers.org. This year, we also started a collegiate competition called Promoting Electric Propulsion, where students, college students are designing ships that are electric-powered for a five-mile competition. They're actually making these ships. And it provided a real opportunity for the students using fleet in K-12, or really the heart for the love of fleet is grades four through seven, High school students use it a little bit to explore force and motion concepts with these great weights. Altogether, this affords students the ability to see future selves that are engineers. The middle school, the late elementary students see the high schoolers doing well in fleet, scoring very high. The high school students can connect to the PEP program, see students actually making these ships hands-on. We really like that long continuum of students looking at other students and how they can become better engineers. We found that in this environment, teachers used fleet more for STEM nights and special events and special weeks, not necessarily the extended classroom use that we had seen before. And we ended up providing a lot more user support for them to be able to get fleet to work in their homes. Looking forward, uh, we're really excited to add some new things to the fleet platform. We're excited to get back into our research of how this is improving access to engineering. If you want to use any of this material, you can go to fleetengineering.org. The game is free. The curriculum's free. And if we can help you directly, please email us fleet at navalengineers.org. We're here to help support your young engineer.